We also have a severe risk. It is a marginal risk. The sort of on a scale of one to five, it's a one, so it's the lightest risk, but it is still an issue where we could see some damaging wind and some hail. Let's go ahead and take a look at uh, the computer model as it gets us uh, through the next couple of days. You can see the storm that is out to our west. So that is the one that we are watching. And the storm risk is not again today. It is coming your way tomorrow with rain and thunder and what could be some potentially flooding rains. But by about 7 a.m., some of those super soakers are going to get going and will be a big deal through the first half of the day, if not a little longer. And then we do get some breaks in the action before another round comes in on Friday that could also bring some heavy rain. But I think our severe chances might be sort of late morning, early afternoon, and then again, late Thursday night, early Friday. So a couple of chances there. And at least one of our computer models is calling for a pretty healthy one inch of rain around most of Metro Detroit. You can see Flint almost an inch and a half. Some other model data does keep the heavier totals closer to the Ohio border. So somewhere within our midst, we should get an inch to an inch and a half through Thursday and the first half of Friday. And again, it's eyes to the skies during that time. If you noticed, we have warmer temperatures. We should be near 70 Ooh. tomorrow, Evrod. And mm -hmm. uh, on our way through the next week or so, staying in the 70s and maybe uh, near 80 degrees this time next week.